and welcome back to Simply Fatima. I'm really excited that you're here for another video. Today's video, I am doing a Louis Vuitton small leather good unboxing. I've been trying to film this unboxing for a while now, but life just keeps happening. Um, other than that, we are here today. We're gonna share in this unboxing and I'm really excited to share with you all this small leather good. Where are my manners? If you're an oldie but a goodie, welcome back. And if you're new, welcome to Simply Fatima where we talk about all things luxury handbags. If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Just go ahead and smash that subscription button. Also make sure to give this video a thumbs up and also make sure to share this video. You might want to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already because I am doing a giveaway. The giveaway prize I have already packed up in my suitcase, but um, I will insert a picture here, and it is the Nolita 19 coach bag in this beautiful neutral cream, like blush, cream blush color that I think will go with any um, outfit that you have. And it's a great everyday bag, a great small little clutch, but I will insert a picture here. All of the entry details will be in the description box down below, so make sure you read the description. So without further ado, let's get into today's video. Before we get into today's video, I do want to catch you up on life. I feel like I have been MIA, which I have been. It's not uncommon for me to kind of just, you know, take a step back from YouTube just to get my life situated and together. Um, the last time we all sat down and chit chat, I was sick as all get out. I had a cold or I had a cold flu situation and I healed from that. Once I healed from that, I was on go, 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 go. When it came to work, I went to um, a conference. Um, I had other little work things that I had to get um, sorted out. In between all of that, your girl did get promoted again at work. So I am very happy and super blessed about that. Um, I've just been doing my thing. I've just been like taking care of myself, doing self care. Also in the midst of all of this, I tried filming my handbag collection, but like it felt like every odd was against me when I filmed it. I finally got a chance to film half of it. I have to go back and film the rest. Um, but I might just film it all over again because it's kind of all over the place. And so there's been a delay in that just because I just had so many hiccups every time I tried to film that video. I promised you all last year in December, beginning of January that I'll get that video out and I am gonna get that video out. I just had a lot of in-between things happen. Um, and like recently, I've just been doing what makes me happy, hanging out with family, hanging out with friends, just catching up on rest, relaxing, um, working hard. And now here we are, finally sitting down, finally filming this video. This SOG that I'm unboxing, I haven't seen it. It came in the mail back in late December, right around New Year's, like the first week or so of New Year's, around that time frame. It's been a while. And I've kept it packaged ever since then. Um, I just opened the box to make, you know, things easier for today's video. But here is the box right here. You see I opened it. Here is the item right here in the bubble wrap and packaging. This item I did purchase pre-love, but it was apps. It was like brand new. The condition said it was brand new. The reason why I purchased this bag um, pre-loved, I was gonna buy this off the Louis Vuitton website. This item is still currently available on the Louis Vuitton website, and I will link it in the description box down below. Um, but the reason why I bought this from Rebag, which is a pre-love um, shop website, um, is because I had a lot of credit um and on top of that i they also gifted me a hundred dollars to go towards something an item and i wanted to just go ahead and use that credit use that a hundred dollars and i pretty much got the small leather good that is basically brand new for practically free i basically stole this item um i'm gonna put the retail price I'm gonna link some of these. Um, I'm going to link the item um, in the description box down below. And I am also going to link the Louis Vuitton website's link as well. 
Um, but yeah, I pretty much got this item for a steal. So here she is wrapped up. And like I mentioned, I purchased this from Rebag. So here it is. Also, I'm pretty sure you see that I'm not in my typical filming space. When I filmed my second to last video, the last time I filmed it in my dining room area and I really appreciate it filming in my dining room area just because I have a table and I can just set everything up at the table. Now in my filming space, I want a table. So I need to find a table to put in my filming space. Plus my filming space is a little bit under construction. Um, but so some of my next few videos might be here or it might be in my filming space. So we're just gonna be traveling around the house. One thing that I like about Rebag is their packaging. Another thing that I like about Rebag is the quality of the bags. I do feel like some of the bags that I have purchased from Rebag, I get a better quality of bag than I would from Fashion File. I really feel like Rebag takes their time to really like, um, like look through the bag, make sure the condition is good because over not too long ago, I was purchasing bags from Fashion File and I would literally send them back because the quality that they said the bag was in in the description was not the quality that I received. And I was just not happy and thrilled. But I can say every time I've ordered something from Rebag, it is in the highest quality, so. And they package everything nicely. So you see how everything came with bubble wrap. The package came wrapped up in this white paper. They even had everything inserted in this plastic bag. Then you get a rebag dust bag. And here is my item in the Louis Vuitton box right here. And then we're just gonna pull her open and it comes with the dust bag. And three, two, one. So the SOG that I purchased is the Emily wallet by Louis Vuitton. I've been really wanting a full size wallet um, and I finally have one. I think it is so pretty. It's in the monogram canvas and it has the rose ballerine interior, which is like their baby pink. I've been in such a huge pink kick recently. I'm not much of a pink person, which is shocking but I've been really into pink lately. Like I have the Long Shop cosmetic bag in the candy pink color. I recently just got a YSL card slash card holder slash wallet situation in Fuchsia. And now I have a long wallet with pink interior. Um, there is six slots for cards. You have a zippered compartment that is right here so you can put bills or chain or loose change in there you have an area that if you still carry like a checkbook you can put a checkbook in this little middle section here and in the back you can place dollar bills in this back pocket and you can also place dollar bills in this other back pocket back here um i think it is the perfect slg especially like for me when i go out of town i like to take a long wallet and a card holder um the long or the larger wallet usually is in my travel bag and then when i want to conveniently carry my mini bags i have a card holder that i can carry as you can see this wallet is literally in pristine condition it doesn't have any kind of smell whatsoever and basically it looks like Whoever had this last never carried it. Um, came with the dust bag, the box. The only thing it didn't come with is the receipt and the ribbon and I don't need that. So this wallet was made in Spain, which I do not mind. I, It's a wallet, it's a wallet to me. So I don't mind that it's made in Spain. It has a snap closure, which is very nice and in good condition. Again, like I said, Rebag does a really good job of inspecting their bags and making sure you're getting the best quality at the best price. Um, and this is a brand new 
wallet and I was able to save money by using my rewards credits as well as the additional credits they provided to me um, to make this wallet even cheaper than purchasing it off of the Louis Vuitton website and I still get a very brand new wallet. No wear, no tear, nobody uses this. Literally, I am the first person to use this beauty right here. And then on top of that, you can also get Rakuten um, cash back with this purchase as well. So I saved tons of money while also making money from purchasing this wallet. Um, but here she is. Here is the front. Here is one side of the wallet and you can see like the peekaboo rose ballerine color. On that side, here is the back, here is the other side, and here is the front. And I am so excited to have this beauty in my collection. Again, like I said, my handbag collection video is gonna be coming out. I had a lot of mishaps, um, so just stay tuned for that. If you own the Emily wallet by Louis Vuitton, let me know down in the comment section down below. If you've ever bought from Rebag, let me know as well and let me know your thoughts. Um, and I just wanted to hop in and share this little cutie with you all really quickly because I've been very patient um, with unboxing this piece because I wanted to unbox it with you all. Um, so if you enjoyed today's video, please give this video a thumbs up. Also make sure to subscribe. You might want to because I am doing a giveaway. The image is right here of the item that I am giving away. And also please follow the entry details in the description box down below. And until next time, my loves, I will talk to you all later. Bye.